Miso, a traditional Japanese seasoning that has been used since the 8th century. It is a fermented paste prepared by inoculating a mixture of soybeans, rice or barley with a mold called koji, Aspergillus oryza. This thick paste is extremely savory with toasted, stinky, salty, sweet richness. Miso is the ultimate reference point for the flavor sensation known as umami, like MSG. A lot of everyday Japanese cooking relies on this umami flavor. Miso is divided into two main categories, the light miso and the dark miso. Light miso, or sweet miso, is for starters. It is mellow and light yellow in color with sweet and refreshing taste thanks to the less soybeans content and a shorter fermentation time. On the other hand, dark miso, sometimes known as red or brown miso, tastes saltier and earthier with the pungency that will strike you right in the sinuses. It requires a longer fermentation time, increased salt content, and more soybeans. Now, let's learn the production process of miso. The required ingredients are soybeans, rice and barley. The type of fungi used is Aspergillus oryza, or known as koji mold. It can break down the proteins and polysaccharides. Also, it helps to overexpress the hydrolytic enzymes. You can also find lactic acid, bacteria, and yeast inside the koji. Lactic acid bacteria, Tetragonococcus halophilus, are found in the final miso product which helps decreasing the pH and increasing the level of unsaturated fatty acids. Zygosaccharomyces ruzi, an important yeast that produces miso flavor components such as furonins and HEMF that gives the appealing aroma of miso. Miso uses batch fermentation mode. There are three types of miso. The first one, in Japanese, they call it memu, which is the soybean malt miso. The second type is gome, rice malt miso, and lastly is the mugi, barley malt miso. The first step in miso production is cooking the ingredients. Soybean, rice, and barley are soaked in the water and steamed. Next, it is the koji production. Koji is made by adding the koji malt into the rice and barley. The koji requires three days mixing in the koji making machine. When the koji is ready, mix it with the steamed soybean, added with salt and water. Put all the ingredients into the fermentation tank for fermentation process. The fermentation and maturation process of miso should take place in a warm room. Lastly, the miso undergoes quality inspection and was packaged for sale. Eating miso is good for your health. It can strengthen your immune system with its high vitamin E, saponin, and amino acid content. It also adds in digestion as it contains probiotics that helps to combat the digestive issues. The most interesting part is that miso can reduce the risk of cancer cell growth and lower the risk of breast cancer. Miso can be stored easily in an airtight container in the refrigerator and can keep for a year and longer. Now, let's recap. Thanks for watching.